<laughs> Thank you. <laughs> So a priest, a rabbi, and a molecular biologist walk into a bar, right? They're sitting down, they're getting ready to order some drinks, have some food. The priest takes his mask off, so does the rabbi. But the molecular biologist keeps his on. And they're all just looking at each other, and, and the marine biologist, molecular biologist, you know how it goes. He asked the priest, why'd you uh, take your mask off? And he said, well, I'm not too worried about the virus, you know, God, God will save me. And he's looks to the rabbi, he's like, what about you? Uh, and he sits there and he's like, you know, well, if God's going to save him, he's definitely going to save me, so I'm not too worried about the virus either. And the priest and rabbi look at each other and they ask him, they're like, hey, you know, what about you? Why are you keeping your mask on? He's like, well, you know, the, the World Health Organization said that if we social distance and wear masks, we could, you know, reduce the spread of COVID by, you know, 80, 90 percent even. And uh, he's like, so I guess science is going to save me. And the priest and rabbi thought this was a little condescending, but whatever. They finish their drinks, and uh, they get up and just beat the shit out of this guy. The priest is fucking throwing hammer fists at the back of his head. The rabbi's kicking him in the dick. Where's your science now, you dumb bitch? What an asshole. And I'm just like, what's the deal with grilled cheese? Who am I fooling? It's just a cheese sandwich. <laughs> Jerry would never say that. You've reached the number for the comedy store. If you would like to leave a message, please include your name and number. Thank you. Hey, uh, this is Chase from the other week. I was just calling to see uh, if you guys were open. I know all about uh, all this crazy shit's going on right now, and I just want to know if uh, if you guys could, you know, keep me posted about what's going on. So if you can call me back when you get the chance, thanks. Thanks for tuning in with us, folks. We have a newcomer here that might shock the world. The World Series of Bowling is not used to seeing this level of pressure, but today the stakes are that high. If this man hits his shot. He could be walking home with $20,000, that's right, $20,000. All he has to do is knock down these pins. He lines up to take his shot, breathing in, focusing. Oh no! What a brutal miss! What an atrocious fucking choke job! What? Right. What to right. Snack break. I'm trying to, all right, but it's just, you don't realize how much anxiety it gives me when she's calling me twice a day, asking me if I'm okay. Like, I have my shit together. Do you really? Yes. Look, I keep my place clean. my place a little bit. Jesus. I can get some work done. I just gotta focus. Maybe clean this place up a little. Okay. So, how you been, Chase? Great, Doc. I got invited to the comedy store. And how are you dealing with the pressure? No pressure at all, to be honest. Just excitement. You think the pills have been working? Yeah, yeah, they're all right. I, I still wish I didn't need them, though. Well, anytime you're under pressure, always remember. Serenity. Serenity. Breathe and repeat my comfort word. Serenity. Serenity. Adderall. Serenity. My old friend.
know, sometimes I, uh, I'll be Netflix and chilling with my girl, and I just keep asking her, one time could we just watch the movie? Is that too much to ask? God, everything has to be about sex. I know this guy knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> Don't want to embarrass you on date night. My bad, pal. This is Chase here again. Sorry to sorry to bother you. I'm sure you guys are busy. Um, yeah, I know we had some gigs coming up, and we don't really know what's going on with all this craziness. Uh, you know, everything they're saying on the news and the virus or whatever. So, uh, you know, if you could just give me a call back, um, I'd really appreciate it. Uh, I'm sure you guys have a lot going on, but uh, yeah, thanks. Oh, Jesus. Kobe! The subscriber you have dialed is not in service. I wanted to hang out with a buddy of mine, and we, you know, he's talking to me, and, he, and we're talking about, you know, let's let's go hang out, let's do something. He's like, "Fuck no, bro, I'm not trying to fuck around and and, and get the corona," and I'm like, "Get the corona? What are you talking about, bro? I just picked up like 24. You throw back coronas all the time. What what's the deal here?" <laughs> I know this guy knows what I'm talking about, Buddha. You can't get a dad bod like that without throwing a few back, right? <laughs> ah. Thank you guys, you've been terrific. I love you guys, thank you so much for having me. Have a good night.
was that? Luda didn't even laugh once. What the fuck was that last joke? You're supposed to leave him with your best material.